collaboration came about, I think kind of the same way a lot of the things came about in my life where, you know, it kind of, it, it's kind of like Charlie's Angel. Like, I just got a phone call one day and, and uh, they approached me at the end of last year, right before Christmas, and just came to the table and said, would you be interested in doing something with us, for us? And anybody that knows the brand knows that they definitely have a, a slight rock and roll edge to them, but a sophistication as well. And I think that's where I was wanting to go into a new direction, is sort of refine my ideas of what that rock and roll aesthetic is to me and what it could mean to me in the future. Like I was almost like designing for the woman that I wanted to be. So, and as far as how much I'm involved, I think anybody that knows me knows that I'm really involved. I'm kind of, it's like the only thing that I'm anal you know about in my life is making sure that like all the little gods are in the detail. For as much as I love clothes, I definitely love jewelry more. So for me, low love has been, um, has been, you know, my baby for about four years. I was digging, 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 searching, searching for, for, for new symbols and new, you know, things that can, can keep all of that. Uh, because with clothing, I think it's, it's kind of easier to come up with something really basic that you want to wear. I think it's, with, with jewelry, because it's an, it feels like an actual like artifact. It feels like it, it's something of substance, and it's so you want it to have some sort of connection to something symbolic, something intellectual, something meaning. I love Peter Ackerman. I think he is extremely talented and mysterious and totally under the radar in a weird way, even though he's extremely successful at the same time. You know, and I mean, Carl who really, like Carl Lagerfeld, he's a, he's a poet and a genius. Um, I think I could like go down the line and just say why I respect every one of them. There isn't one person that can stand out, but it's me, no. <laughs> I can't even call myself a designer. That's crazy, I call myself a curator. 